And welcome back, guys. So I did some homework, and it appears that you can steal from other people's camps. Like, loot their stuff from, like, a box and stuff like that, and you can break their structures. However, if they got turrets, those turrets will shoot at that user after they break something. So, I mean, yeah, it works both ways. Uh, apparently, if you kill a player on here, you get a bounty on your head. It's like 50 caps or something like that. So, either way, if someone does something negative, it screws that person over. So, I don't know. I think I'm just going to pick up my camp for now on before, when I log off of here. This makes life easier, I guess. Funny story regarding the camps. Apparently, you can store your entire camp inside of your little camp robot thing. Trying to up the amount of caps I have right now. 45 damage, 12. Uh, yeah, right, we'll do some questing here. We'll try to finish up our stuff up in that one area. Still haven't figured out how to throw mollies at. I end up uh, making a bunch of fusion cells though, so I'm happy about that. I'm so excited. Okay. So this is doing 44 meg, 44s. Shells. Get rid of this. Just de wean my inventory before we go out. Uh, but yeah, I found a nice cozy spot for my camp temporarily. Um, I like the idea of me picking up my camp and logging out because apparently everything stays on your character when you log out. So even if someone goes to loot you, they can't loot your camp if it's not placed down apparently. So that's a good little loophole right there. Watch, as soon as I say it, their Bethesda's is going to go patch it probably, huh? I would not be surprised. Uh, 308. Just trying to get rid of anything that I'm not, you know, needing right now. Definitely need to get some armor. I definitely got to get the whole issue of needing to be able to pick up more stuff, basically. So I gotta weed all this crap out. Um, let's see here. Got plenty of where I'd wait. I wanna get at least one more health kit here. Or stem pack as we call them. More junk, okay. Um, I think we're good. Let me just check the... I think we're fine. So we'll finish off the pioneer questing I think we're gonna do here. I don't like how close this guy's getting. I get it, he's in the ass end of nowhere. I put my camp literally right here. I have no idea that there's a vault right here. I have no idea. Apparently there's a vault right here in the middle. So I may have to move my camp again. 
sitting there rolling my eyes. I just moved it. <laughs> uh, figures, huh? I'm pissed that I can't build over here. This would have been perfect away from all that crap, but nah. Talk to Pi Tam leader, yeah. I wanna walk all the way over there. I might as well just teleport to this poor bastard's camp over there. Alright. Let's go up here. Let's hope he doesn't kill us. I don't think he will. Let's find out. <laughs> da, 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 da. I might have to play some Fallout 4 music or some kind of music here and just to pass the time. It would be worth that copyright strike. <laughs> Not being bored with you know, no music at all. I know YouTube's looking at me like, excuse me? Wow, it's got a cute place back here. Problem running low on water. Well, I don't know about you, but oh. I'm just not very fond of all this smell toxic waste. It's always nice to meet a new Pioneer Scout. I love nature. Don't you? Pioneer Scouts love all of nature. Even the smelly skunks and ugly opossums. Can you say opossum? Good. One thing all the boys and girls of Pioneer Scout hate is toxic mutagenic waste. Can you say toxic mutagenic waste? It's yuck. Up. Pioneer Scouts used to pick up trash to earn a badge. That's pretty futile now. Can you say futile? I knew you could. You earn a badge by cleaning up nasty old toxic mutagenic waste and putting it in a containment barrel. Can you say containment barrel? I knew you could. Now run along and earn that badge. Toxic mutagenic waste make a serious genetic modification some I was hoping it might be nice to come over here and uh, kill this fucker, but uh, I guess not. Anyway, so I'm just gonna hang out in here. See if I can. And of course, it doesn't tell me how. Uh, it's gonna be an easy way.
I don't want to be in third person. Probably so on your level to be doing this right now. Gotta do it anyways. Wow, this place got hit hard. What am I doing here? Get new paper target. Gained a level. Wonder what it could be. Comes do twenty percent, five percent damage with chance to cripple your opponent. Yep, I screwed it up. That's all right.
I know, I'm kind of having fun, but I'm kind of not. It's just one of those things. Kind of spread down the middle at this point, just kind of like, eh, yeah. mid-level on this. I'm just kind of like, eh, eh. Found a good farming spot for Scorch. <laughs> like to shoot things up? This is the place for you. Fire away for the cheapest price in Appalachia. I'm going to take advantage of this. There's less of them here. That could mean a couple of things. It could be that guy that was here. Clear them out. This last time I was out here doing quests in this area. There are so many scorched. Just kind of looked at it like, uh, hell no. Yes, pure for more. Thank you. Thank you so much. Why shoot tin cans off of rocks when you can put a real target in your sights? Picked up beer balls. Anybody's up a camp out there? The problem is it doesn't tell you where to pick up beer bottles. All it says is pick up beer bottles, period. It's like customers are limited to three cans of beer when shot. Alrighty. Eh, I'm having fun, you know. To a certain degree, now that I'm figuring things out. The hard part is figuring things out. It's not like the other fallouts where it was really easy to figure things out. Yeah, this has taken me probably, if I wasn't playing non-stop, probably four days, five days, just to figure out the basics. So, yeah. Kind of like, yeah. I gotta go over here, probably. Something. Okay, we have a robot up there. Not looking good. There's a wall there. Ow. Robots are not friendly.
I missed my EDO already. Oh yeah, I played Fallout 4. Do not attempt to play. You will be identified and sanctioned. You think so? I just don't have it on the channel yet for you guys. I will Intruder. get there eventually. Identify yourself. <laughs> Guessing he's on the roof up there. Anytime you see the ground smoking like that, it's probably not steam. It's probably nuclear aftermath. Or a coal mine on fire, something, you know, regarding that nature. Something bad. Too bad I don't know how to throw the damn thing. Holy shit. I was just looking at the rat counter go up. I'm like, holy shit. Yes, this is what you should be having your scouts do. Clean up toxic sludge. No, not really. Shit, it's toxic fucking orange. Anytime you see orange wire, that is a bad sign. Like, even you got feral ghouls dying down here. I'm probably just walking in a nuclear winter wonderland down here. Walking in a nickel winter underland. Attention citizens, nuclear strike imminent. Ah shit, where are you Please nuke? exit the area at your earliest convenience. They Thank probably are nuking this area. Operation. To get enemies that are gonna mutate and all that crap. This supposedly seems to be the hard area, supposedly. Supposedly. I like how you can just pick up your camp and move. Don't like how close this player here is getting to my camp. Get too much closer, and then I will pick my camp up. But yeah, 
Only problem is if you pick a camp up and you still have a bunch of stuff on you, they can take the stuff off of you. So, that's why I'm like, hmm, if I put my stuff into the camp and just keep the basic gear of a couple pistols and stuff on me, then I'll be fine, right? In theory, that would work. I'm gonna run past your bullshit. There's never here, I'm just gonna walk over right here. Young tadpoles are the lifeblood of the Pioneer Scouts. Make his turrets do the work. I don't think I'm losing too much, but we'll find out. We'll spawn here, run over to his camp, grab my shit. I might join it. I just trying to lead the uh, rad scope into his stuff. Cool, and you just went on. Made me fucking jump. Can you please screw off. Ow. I made that ammo that when I did. Said something about joining a camp. He's doing the same as me trying to get here.
Alright, I'm just trying to calculate my next move here. Where's the top of the price values? Kindness, receipt, five, and ally. Doing this for a backpack, by the way. Spare the caps. I probably shouldn't be going to these locations so early. But fuck it, why not, right? A couple of things I could do is I could keep setting up a camp with some turrets and just, just farm that area. And any scorch that comes up with guns, I could do it that way. But that's still not very ideal because you're constantly moving your camp around, so it gets annoying after a while. He had fun. Shouldn't have gotten rid of that boiled water. <laughs> Seems very peaceful out here, actually. So the more you move your camp, the more expensive it gets, it would seem. Just gotta make sure you got plenty of caps, and you'll be fine. Hearing, I'm hearing some bad shit. Like a hum. Some kind of graphic called glitch going on here where I'm seeing like ghost images. Not exactly a good experience. It goes away after a while, but still, it's not a good experience. I hear something. Uh, 
detect. Level 40. I'm glad it was more interested in the ticks than me. Up beer bottles. One, two, three. Okay, so three, four, five. Any beer bottles? Old possum. Ooh, type rare. I think there's a zombie here somewhere. Sounds like it's outside. Looking around to see if there's anything else useful in this. That might be useful. Sounds like I have an unexpected. I can spawn back, the problem is it's uh, that fucker standing right there. You're suffering from rad worms, that's great. I knew I was getting stalked by something, I just didn't know what. I thought it was like a zombie or something. Gotta wait for him to fuck off, I guess. Okay, you can fuck off. <laughs> the reaction of me going, holy shit. <laughs> well, what would you do if that was coming right at you? There's no way it just saw me. Fucking did it. It's a level 40. I shouldn't be over here.
No. If I close the doors, I'll stay out there. Okay, come for me to get the fuck out of here. I'm gonna talk to him real quick and get the fuck out of here. The word of advice. Word of advice. Get out of here. Spider with a red hourglass on its abdomen. You should take care to avoid it. Oh great, another tadpole. I was once the assistant to a world-renowned entomologist. Now, I'm a pioneer scout leader. I bet you don't even know what an entomologist is. The last tadpole kept saying entomologist. I hit him with a dictionary. Actually, my program didn't let me. But I wanted to, really badly. Entomology is the study of bugs, not words. And there are far too many bugs around these days. When did they get so big? I've been continuing my previous primary investigator's work. If you could get me some insect parts from these new species, I could fashion an insect repellent. Here's a list. I've marked some places where you might find the right species. But really, the parts can come from anywhere. Have you gotten my insect samples yet? Great. More insect samples. Crap. I need those insect parts to make the repellent. Have you got my insect samples yet? I have a feeling we're not supposed to be here yet. <laughs> I, I think I'm better off going with these quests the first. Uh, opening the wire valve at Orange Bar Park. I think I'm better off going with these. than I am to go over here because this seems like super high level stuff. Have you gotten my insect samples yet? There's something very bad outside of me. Um build the crane. I need those insect parts to make the repellent. All right, teleport over here. It says learn how to make the thingy. I gotta go see if I can make it. I don't think I can. My humble abode from home away from home. So I went AFK here for a little bit. And I don't think this damage is from someone shooting at it. Uh, literally like three or four scorch rolled up on my ass. I'm like, the fuck?
Uh, circuit board is required. Okay, so how the hell do I get a circuit board? Hmm. Hot plates. So I have an idea of where I can find a hot plate. There's a red rocket down here. Yeah, I'm gonna go there. Hopefully I don't run out of caps. I only have a limited amount of caps. Probably should sell stuff soon. <laughs> probably is one of the things I should probably do is grind. Do a little bit of farming. Get some tier guns. Kind of curious what this one player is doing over there. It's hard work making a living out here. <laughs> These fuckers are bad. Just when I thought I would not see another red roach. I know. I YouTube's looking at me. Stop swearing. <laughs> oh, building this place up is hard work. Come back to this area. They'll all want to be setting up places like Foundation. I'll speak of this Foundation place, but I just don't see it. They're mostly hanging out down here. I might come visit them. I don't know how you drop items, because otherwise I would. So hot plates, typewriters. That kind of is what we're looking for. I press the button. Hush. I think it's recording now. Shush. Hello. Hello there. Oh, I think it's working. <laughs> I hate these things. 
This is Willie May, and I was asked to talk a bit about my life since the war to help educate future children someday. <coughs> I thought I would just watch my friends and the grandkids in my retirement, but that didn't turn out to be the case. I'm just glad they all made it to the vault in time, you see. When I saw it in a dream, I knew my prayers were answered. My husband Frank used to work in the mines. Just a bit before the war, there was news of tremors. He didn't come home. I don't know what happened to him or why he never came home for sure. And between you and me, I'm fine with that. Should be a Since red war, rocket. I've just read my old newspapers. Back that way. But I'm looking this music. way. First. Very peaceful for once. Which is just right nice by There's me. There's a med kit thing down here. That's why I'm going down here. I want to see if it's refreshed. You ever hear of the Watoga Times Atomic Lottery? It is. The winner got 10 years worth of Blamco mac and cheese, and Salisbury steak, and, and Nuka Cola, of course. I played that lottery. It's nice at seeing that stuff respond. And I finally won the month before the war. I need a hot plate, it lasted man. lasted only eight years, though. But who can you complain to? I want the circuits out of it. By the time it ran out, I had heard the responders' radio broadcast, so I went out to find them and get supplies. Bless their hearts. Well, I'm going home now. For a bit, anyway. How do I turn this thing off? Oh, blast these things. <laughs> not this button. Not this one. Oh, <laughs> oh, here it is. Well, at least I know I don't have to buy health kits. I can just come back over here. History and that. Uh, it's never a hot play around when you need one. Look at me like, damn, that's nasty. Well, that's a real thing. You can ask the Duke real possum. Doesn't it sound so delightful? More rat chunks. Mmm. Sounds yummy. Sounds ass or gross. It's food, right? Sounds great. Not really. I gotta go and... Oh, hi. Oh, you're not... You're gonna attack me. Cool. It's about to light it up. I'm trying to get more blueprints unlocked. It's taking forever.
nice to know this stuff responds when you log out. Uh, how is this a good thing? Because that now I now that I know this stuff responds, I can anytime I log out and I really need caps and I'm like scraping the barrel, all I have to do is shut the game down, boot it back up, sit there, play 21 questions with getting it to recognize that I'm running this off a computer, get into the server, do it again. Well, I'm talking like emergency situation where, you know, you, you got like zero caps and, you know, you need something to start off with, so. I'm looking for hot plates. Surprisingly, something that has circuit boards. Not useful. I was speaking, not what I'm looking for. Ooh. Alright, we're getting warmer. Apple, not what I'm looking for. What's that over there? Need some toothpaste. Need some soap. Pretty sure I've been in here already. There's a bone saw on the floor. Roach in there. Got some scroll bites in there. Recipe. And Nuka Cola, pork and beans. Can I take the ammo? This goes a red rocket. I was really hoping you you could sell boiled boiled water. Guess not. So I'm guessing because this guy has built his camp up here, I'm guessing you can put down water facilities to make water anywhere but if you claim one of these you become more of a target if you do that that's just what it seems like As I see anyone trying to go this way, I'm just going to move it. That's how it is. You know, the person could be friendly and trying to bring me something, but highly unlikely. Holy 
crap, he is 1,513. That's how many caps you'll get if you kill him. Got a nice little spot in the hills there. What's this? I'm guessing I need to be at least level 50 to 100 to be in this area, because there's some tough shit here. If just walking over to here was level 40 enemies, that means that starting from here and going this way, still equally hard, but doable, is what I'm saying here. Holy crap, one hour and... That many minutes. All right, I'll try to make this quick, guys. I'm gonna run up to the red rocket. Next time you see us, hopefully we'll be making that sign, doing that quest. I'm gonna try to find more quests to do, but it's kind of hard. Hi. I was looking for you. Oh, you didn't die. Third, there you are. Come on, hot plate. Watch, there's not going to be a hot plate in there. Sitting there like, damn, he's swearing a lot. It's a nasty habit. It's on the pro list to not. Oh man, it's not gonna give me what I need. Circuit board, telephone. That's surprising. Well, I now know what gives what. Alright guys, I'm mostly going to go farm for like circuit boards and stuff. I'm going to probably make the uh, one thing real quick here for you guys to watch me make and do that quest real quick. Try to keep the videos down to 45 to an hour if I can, but it's kind of like, you know, it, it's just difficult to try to keep it simple. Move my camp. Like, I'm gonna leave it there, but I'm going to put everything in the camp. As far as I know, you can't act, interact with the camp thing, so okay, that's good. Also, it sucks that you can't just leave your stuff out.
Park it more. Attention citizens, nuclear strike imminent. Please exit the area at your earliest convenience. Thank you for your cooperation. Alright, power. Alrighty. People are like, duh. Power. No copper. Pretty sure all this stuff should be going inside the camp thing, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that.
Got a wide man campsite over there. I did that wrong, but it's all good. I don't understand why they keep nuking that one spot when they don't even go in there to do anything. Uses for producing copper too. All right, guys, I'm gonna go look for the damn fuse. Make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe button. I'll see you guys in the next video. Hopefully, I'll have this damn fuse and we can fire this quest up by then. But it really depends if I can find it. This copper, copper is kind of important. Anyways, I'll see you guys again soon.